Hey guys, it is Christian here, and I'm just going to do a video cringing at the Met Gala for 2021. I'm not going to do this video every year. I'm only going to do it this year. I'm going to cringe at all the cr at all the crap that happened. We're going to look through like some of the people who were there. It's, it's going to be nuts. But for instance, this was like, describe to me, what did you think of this? So I'm not. A, I'm aware of most of the outfits. The main ones that have been talked about, I know about what AOC wore, she's in Congress. I know about what Cara Delvine wa wore, sorry if I totally mispronounced that name. I know that Megan Rapinoe was there, Elliot Page was there, Lil Nas was wearing gold. We had celebrities there, we had TikTok stars there, we had YouTubers there. It was nuts, so let's just look at all the crap. Okay, so I don't know what Kim Kardashian is wearing. Like, what is that? Seriously, it's covering her face like, oh my gosh, this is nuts. We're probably going to see like AOC on here or something because they love political statements on clothing. But yeah, I know that's Kim Kardashian because I know like what she wore, it was like all covered. It was so weird. Gosh. Is that, oh, is that Lupita? Well, Lupita Nyong'o is a good actress, so I, I can give you that. And she doesn't look that bad. And she looks pretty good, though. Call me a simp in the comments. Even though I'm totally not a simp. Who's next? Oh, is that Rih It's Rihanna and ASAP Rocky. They're, like, singers. And why does it look like they're wearing blankets? It looks like it looks like ASAP Rocky's, like, wrapped in a blanket. It, like, what is that? <laughs> Seriously. Like, what is that? Next. Oh, that's uh, the, the, the the person from Blackish. Uh, Tracy Ellis Ross. She looks fine, I guess. She looks pretty good, I guess. Next. J Balvin and someone from RuPaul's Drag Race. So it's J Balvin and a drag queen. Oh, J Balvin. He looks to be like the only rich. He seems to be the only elitist here wearing a mask. I guess, good for you, I guess. So, yeah, because these people don't, aren't wearing masks. He's the only one that's actually, like, kind of wearing a mask, so. I guess. Meanwhile, like, all the camera people are wearing masks. And then I have someone from RuPaul's Drag Race, so it's a drag queen. So, yeah. Well, oh, is that uh, Jennifer Lopez? Yes, it is. Yeah, it's uh, Jennifer Lopez. So she was there. So that's cool. Not oh Olivia Rodrigo. She she sings songs about getting driver's license. She makes a lot of pop songs that I don't listen to. She was she was in the high school musical show. Like okay. And she was also I think she also teamed up with like Joe Biden for something. But she's there, so cool. Uh, I think that's a, I think that's another singer or a social media person. Yeah, I don't even know who that is. I'm sorry. Who is that? That is someone from Euphoria. She looks like the actress from The Crown. What's her name? Uh, Emma Corrin. She looks like Emma Corrin a little bit. Maybe it's just the face, but it kind of looks like. Emma Corrin, who played Diana in The Crown. I don't watch her show, but I know she played Diana in the show. Oh, she she won a Golden Globe for it. She might win an Emmy as well. Next. Who's Frank Ocean, and he's holding a baby doll. No, it's a robotic friend. I don't even know what that is. He has green hair. Cool. Green's my favorite color. I like green. And he's... Well, I don't think that's a real baby. I think it, it said it's robotic, and then, so, yeah. Oh, is that Gabrielle Union? Yeah, that's Gabrielle. Oh, wait, yeah, that's Gabrielle Union. She's mar I think she's married to Dwayne Wade, who's a basketball player. She looks good, I guess. Is that, that looks like Simone Biles. Is that Simone Biles? Yeah, that's Simone Biles. I heard... I heard a lot of stuff about her during the Olympics, how she, like, quit, and then she came back. 
Feels good though. Oh, of course, ASC. ASC, okay. She's uh, in Congress. She wore something saying, tax the rich. A lot of people have been torturing her for that. Like, torturing her. And for this, all the right-wing pundits, they're all torturing her for this. It's like, oh my goodness. Of course, you're going to see some clothing with, like, political statements. That, that's expected. Like, that's clearly expected for stuff like this. But, yeah. So, but that's AOC, also known as Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez. Who is that? Precious. No, I don't even know who that is. Who is that? Oh, it's Kendall Jenner. I, I don't care. Moving on. Her with someone else. I don't even know. Okay. What the hell is that? She's wearing a horse. Like, thing. Like, what? what is that? Yeah, it's a horse head. Head right on the torso. Like, my God, what is that? That's nuts. That's crazy. Who is... Oh, oh that's Alicia Keys. I know who that is. Yeah, she's a singer. She looks fine, I guess. She looks pretty good. Next, I think that's an athlete. Yeah, it's an athlete. I don't know who that is. Camila Cabello and Shawn Mendes. She was in that dreadful Cinderella movie. I don't have that much to say about it. I don't even know who that is. Oh, Megan Fox, yeah. Yeah, I know who she is. She's an actress who I haven't seen in a single good movie. I haven't seen I haven't, I haven't seen her give a single good performance. So yeah. Uh, okay. Well, I heard that Jennifer body, Jennifer's body is pretty decent, but I haven't seen that movie, so can't comment. Rare that movie I've seen her in is not good. Oh, Emily Blunt, she's good. She's a good actress. So, yeah. Yeah, she's actually, I think she actually is in my top ten favorite actresses. She's great. She's in A Quiet Place. She's in, uh, she was in the Jungle Cruise movie, which I didn't really think. That was that amazing? She's in a quiet place. She was, I think she was Mary Poppins in Mary Poppins Returns. Yeah, she's great. She looks good though. Next one. Oh, is that Regina King? Regina King's good. Okay. Maybe she looks nice. I guess. Not that much to say about these, honestly. I'm mainly talking about the. Oh, Megan Rapino. Yeah, I talked about this in the beginning. And she's a soccer player who constantly talks about politics. And she's even making a political statement here with a card saying, and gay we trust. Okay? Okay? She gets a lot of heat from these, like, sport anti-SGW channels. Well, it was mainly, like, black and white sports. They talk, they talk crap about Megan Rapinoe a lot, along with people like... They like to talk about they like to talk crap about LeBron James like a lot. They like to talk crap about Megan Rapinoe a lot. They they all talked crap about Simone Biles when the Olympics were a thing. Like my goodness, who's next? I don't even know who that. Oh, that's Lord. I think I might have heard of her before, but whatever. Oh, Justin Bieber. I hate Justin Bieber. No, 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 no. We're moving on. I don't like Justin Bieber. Who is that? I don't even know who that is. Moving on. Who is that? I don't even know who that is. Okay. Oh, Lil Nas X. Yeah, we have to talk about this one. He's wearing, like, this cloak. He's wearing a very long, like, cloak. And that's only one of his looks. His second one was all gold. Probably cost more than anything I own. But it was all gold. And his second one was just this under thing. I don't even know how to describe it. Oh, Billie Eilish. Yeah, that was one of the headliners. I know she did the song for the new James Bond movie. Her hair kind of reminds me of Marilyn Monroe a little bit. She looked good, even though I don't listen to her music that much. Who is that? I don't know. 
Oh, she's the stepdaughter of uh, Kamala Harris, who's the vice president. Okay. Megan Thee Stallion. Oh, no. She did that awful song with uh, Cardi B. What was... Yeah, what? That song is just atrocious. I tried to listen to it, like, last year, and I couldn't even listen to the whole thing. It was disgusting, okay? Hey, but that's Megan Thee Stallion. Who is that? She... She's wearing a mask, too. Grimes. Oh, she wore something that was inspired by Dune. Okay. I like that, because Dune looks like an awesome movie. She's wearing a mask, too. I'm with you. But because usually a lot of you rich people aren't wearing the mask, meanwhile, all your camera people are. But I think it's good to see that these people are wearing masks, because it proves that, th that as they claim, we're all in this together. Even though they're there and we're just in our homes. Oh, that's Serena Williams. Yeah, she's a tennis player. And there's also a movie coming out later this year called King Richard, which is about her father. And her father's going to be played by Will Smith. That movie looks pretty good. Julia Garner, she's on Ozark. That's, that's, how, that's how I know Julia Garner. She looks, she looks good, I guess. Who is that? I don't even know who that is. Moving on. Oh, Dan Levy. I know. He's on Schitt's Creek. He's wearing something. I don't even know what he's wearing. Oh, he's wearing something with a... It's it's an LGBT representation thing, I guess. That's cool. Well, it is cool. Well, it's nice to see it. I don't even know who that is. Timothy Chalamet. He's he's gonna be in Dune. I don't I don't like to sit for male actors because it's gonna make me look like I'm gay. But it looks pretty good, I guess. Actually, I'm not even dating. I'm not even dating yet. I'm only I'm only 13 years old. I can't date. Probably won't be dating in the next like three years. Who's next? Oh, it's Macy Williams. She's on um, Game of Thrones. She said that this was inspired by The Matrix, which is good, I guess. Yeah, she's on Game of Thrones, and she was also in the New Mutants movie last year, which that movie was a curse for a pretty long time, but it finally came out last year, and now no one's talking about it. I don't know who that is. Moving on. Oh, that's a gymnast. I don't even know who that is either. Oh, Emma Chamberlain, she's a social media YouTuber. Oh, I don't watch popular YouTubers, though. I only watch movie YouTubers, really. Another another congresswoman wearing another political thing. Anything about equal rights for women. Cool. Uh, that's the marching band wearing red, white, and blue. Good, oh, good for America representation. I love America. Great country. And that's it. And that's it. Also, Addison Ray was there. She's on TikTok. She was also in He's All That. The Netflix movie that was trash. That's pretty much everything that was on this article. But, yeah. I didn't have that much to say about it, honestly. Like, I just didn't have that much to say about it. So... That was my video basically cringing at the Met Gala. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. And see you guys next time. Bye.